Hi friends, welcome to Airdrop Spot and welcome to Movement Labs Testnet. So to begin today's testnet, we need to download Razor Wallet. So I am going to visit razorwallet.xyz. Tap on download for Chrome. Now tap on add to Chrome to add the extension to your browser. Tap on OK. Now once your extension is done downloading, it will automatically take you here then. Check that checkbox then tap on start. Now you can decide to create a new wallet for movement testnet or you can decide to import your MetaMask seed phrase. What I did was to import my MetaMask seed phrase but at the end of the day I do not think it matters and here is why I said that. So you are going to see MEVM DevNet, tap on it, then choose M1 DevNet, that is the network that we want to use. Now you will see once I change to M1 DevNet, my wallet address also changed, that is why I said I don't think it matters whether you imported your MetaMask seed phrase or not. So I'm going to tap on Faucet to get test tokens. But then every time I tap on faucet, I kept getting faucet filled. So what I did was to just leave the whole thing and then I went back the next day. But as I opened the wallet today, I saw 10 move, which means I have now gotten the test tokens. Although I can't say whether uh, this is a result of me using the faucet several times or I, I was supposed to get 10 move at once. But then whatever the case may be, now I have test tokens. So I'm going to open up a new tab. And then I'm going to paste the link to Razordex. So here you can see that uh, my wallet is already connected. I am going to swap move into it this time. So I'm going to tap on it. Then I'll enter the amount of move that I want to swap. So I'll be swapping 5 move for it. I'll tap on confirm swap. And then I'm going to sign the transaction in my wallet. The transaction is successful. You can see my balance have changed. So I'm going to move over to the pull tab. I am going to tap on add liquidity and in the first drop down I am going to select move while in the second drop down I am going to select it. Now I am going to decay the amount of move that I want to add to the liquidity pool and then the appropriate amount of it would be added then I will tap on supply. I'll tap on confirm supply and then sign the transaction in my wallet. Transaction successful, you can see my position at the bottom. So if you go to the token tab, there is actually nothing to do there, but then you can there you can see all of the available liquidity pool pair. Okay, you can see it and USDC, BTC, USDT and all of them. You can decide to interact with any one of them. But because my test token is very limited, I'm just going to leave it at move and if for now. If you tap on your liquidity position, you can then decide to add more tokens or remove uh, some of the tokens from the pool. But I won't be doing any of such for now. I am going to open up another tab and I'm going to paste the link to GALS. So to do anything here, I have to log in. So I'll tap on login and I will connect with MetaMask. I'll tap on sign in. Okay, here we are. The first thing I want to do is to follow movement. I'll tap on follow. I've done that. Then I'll tap on daily test quest one. 
so this is just a sample test they are still going to have some more serious tests that we can do but then this is just a sample quest if you tap on it and you tap on continue to access it takes you to google normally uh task one is supposed to probably take you to their website or uh, another place not just google so this is just a sample test they are still going to add more tests later however i've done what they required so i'll tap on refresh button and then claim five points then i will move over to the second test and this test is to visit their twitter page so i'll tap on it I'll tap on the follow button to follow them and then go back to Gal. Then I'm going to try and refresh. It was not going through so I decided to just leave this one and try to verify it later. So I moved over to the next uh, task. This one is a permanent test and you are meant to watch two YouTube videos. But then I'm going to pause this video and once I'm done watching the two videos, I will come back so uh this is the second uh, test that wasn't going through earlier it is now verified and i have claimed five points so i'll go back to the last test which was to watch two youtube videos and i have claimed uh, 10 points for it as well i did that before resuming my video so that's it that's all about their girls quest for now okay so this is everything that we have we have done everything and then remember that uh, quest one and two they are daily quests you have to come back every day and then complete the quest and then claim 10 points only the last one is a permanent quest which you can only claim the points once there's really nothing much to do on movement test net at the moment so you want to make sure to stay subscribed to my channel so that when there is a new update on movement test net we are all going to be informed if you have any questions drop me a comment in the comment section of this video don't forget to join us on telegram you'll find the link in the pinned comment and as well all the links i used for this testnet tutorial thank you for watching i'll see you in another tutorial